synthetic fibers. We all wear clothes to protect our body and sometimes to enhance our beauty. Clothes which we wear are made of fabrics. Fabrics are made from fibers obtained from natural or artificial sources. Natural fibers are obtained from plants and animals. And what are synthetic fibers? Synthetic fibers are made by human beings. Synthetic fibers is a chain of small repeating units joined together. These are chemical substances. This small unit is called a monomer. And a large single unit is called a polymer. These are recharged using raw materials of petroleum origin and are called petrochemicals. Types of synthetic fibers rayon, nylon, polyester, and acrylic. Rayon. Rayon has a shining fiber property obtained by chemical treatment of a wood pulp and has similar properties to that of silk. Therefore, it is also known as artificial silk. Although rayon is obtained from a natural source, wood pulp, it is a man-made fiber. In fact, silk from silkworm was discovered in China and was kept a secret. It was very costly also, and then scientists prepared rayon, the artificial silk. Characteristics of rayon It has a shine like silk. It can be woven like silk fibers. It can be dyed into a wide variety of colors. Use of rayon Mixed with cotton to make bed sheets. It is also mixed with wool to make carpets. Nylon Nylon is the first fully synthetic fiber prepared from coal water and air in 1931. It is stronger than a steel wire. It is elastic and light. It is lustrous and easy to wash. Use of Nylon Nylon is used in the making of clothes, socks, ropes, tents, toothbrushes, curtains, car seat belts, sleeping bags and parachutes amongst many other things. Polyester and Acrylic Polyester is made up of the repeating units of a chemical called ester. Some popular polyesters are terylene and PET. Characteristics of polyester terylene. It does not get wrinkled easily. It is crisp and easy to wash. It is a fine fiber and can be woven like any other yarn. Use of terylene. Terylene is used in the making of clothes. Use of PET PET is used for making bottles, utensils, 
films and wires. Acrylic Acrylic is a synthetic fiber that has replaced wool. Characteristics of acrylic It is relatively cheaper than wool, available in variety of colors, more durable, more affordable. Use of acrylic Acrylic is used to make shawls, blankets and sweaters. Characteristics of synthetic fibers Synthetic fibers are durable, less expensive, easy to maintain, readily available. Disadvantage of synthetic fiber If the synthetic fiber catches fire, it melts and sticks to the body of the person wearing it. So, we should not wear synthetic clothes while working in the kitchen or in a laboratory. Plastics Plastic is a polymer and is widely used. Some plastics have linear arrangement of matter. Some plastics have cross-linked. Types of plastics Thermoplastic and thermosetting plastics What are thermoplastic? Such plastic which gets deformed easily on heating and can be bent easily by humans are known as thermoplastic. Examples of thermoplastics are polythene and PVC. Thermal setting plastics such plastics which cannot be softened by heating and so can't be remodeled are called thermosetting plastics. Examples are bakelite, melamine. Why plastics are materials of choice? Plastic is very light. Plastic is very strong. Plastic is durable. Plastic is cheaper than metals. Plastic is a poor conductor of heat and electricity. Non-slicking. Some plastics are fireproof. Is the use of plastic environment friendly? An environment-friendly material is one that gets decomposed through natural processes such as action by bacteria. Such material is called biodegradable. A material which is not easily decomposed by natural processes is termed non-degradable. Plastics take several years to decompose, so it is not environment friendly. This is a non-biodegradable waste. It does not get completely burned easily and produces lot of poisonous fumes into the atmosphere causing air pollution. Then, what should we do? We should avoid the use of plastics as far as possible. Make use 
of natural fibers like cotton and jute bags. Do not throw plastic bags in the water bodies or on the road. Recycle the plastic wastes. Thermoplastic can be recycled. Remember the 4R principle. Reduce, reuse, recycle, recover.